Fortnite playback. Um, okay, and a couple of things that occurred. So the last video we uploaded on this channel was talking about Sneeko. We kind of get a rebuttal to Wait, him calling us out. He said that we're not being genuine or being, you know, disingenuous about our Ugh, takes. He says Chris, that hey, ain't nobody doing nothing for me. I'm sorry. Did time out to actually no, um, rebuttal to that. Because of that, he like invited us on his stream. No. We had a back and forth conversation about no, it. No, I'm Look, not with that's that. That's not a crime to censor yourself. If you want to censor yourself because you want to, like Adrian is saying, fall within a certain... Realm. It's not I censorship, think, though. If, if you don't, you if can't... someone, if I ask you your honest opinion on something, and then you voluntarily don't tell, say it because you are, um, you know it's you're, you, you're, you're worried about the repercussions. That is a form of censorship. A lot of things I learned, man. I didn't feel comfortable. A couple of things, me personally. I don't want to speak for me. I don't. Oh want, wow. I don't want our opinions to get mixed up now. Okay. Me personally, I felt a little uncomfortable. But first, um, I, I do want to say this. Look, the ongoing conversation of you know YouTubers censoring each other. You know, we got to censor ourselves. I find. It personally, uh, See, understanding. Child, I don't know if it's that. I'm just not into it, bro. If there's a benefit, and also if they're still being genuine to who they are. Sneeko called us out because he said that we censor ourselves on um, podcasts, which I thought was interesting. Because if y'all want to hear the things we got to say that we censor out, don't you Google it. Don't Patreon, Google it. Don't 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 Young Don, Sneeko, just, the song's I didn't, God. I didn't get that point. I, okay, and Sneeko being then friends. Then he went on to claim that it's you know, crazy. we censor ourselves because we didn't talk about certain sense. things, you know, passing things such as the um, trans oh, situation. Why is it? And the you were basically saying you don't care because about it. You don't have an opinion. Their on opinions it. are so are so opposite, but I guess it 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 kind of lines up they are? at one point. Yeah. Oh, what is Sneeko's like? Let's say for example, Sneeko's opinion on. Um, and I don't want to have a whole debate on this, but yeah, you gotta, you gotta remember, you gotta remember, Don is a, I don't know what his opinion on abortion is, but Don okay. is a hardcore Christian. Yeah. You know I'm saying like down to the letter, down to the oh. team, if you ask him exactly, you know what I'm saying? So to get there and then get to what Sneeko's saying, it's so opposite. Their opinions are so opposite. But I guess it makes I, it Hi there, we are hold open casting calls for a couple nuts. of shoots. We would love to receive no, audition Rose, tape. Please don't donate again. I'm okay. I'm okay. I I'm, 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 I'm playing. I'm playing. Yeah. Feel like things about me and my life. No, 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 I've, no, no. I've said I'm just talking in general. I'm just talking in general. Like, well, no, ma you, majority. Uh, okay, all right. Let me ask you guys both a question. Here's just a random. Do you think? Do you think? Um. Do you think a man can be a woman? Do you no. think a man? A, a man can be like a. Do you believe that trans? What was it called? Do you believe that trans transsexuals? Like, do you think there is ever a legitimate situation where a man is in the wrong body or a woman's in the wrong body or are? Say, so you see? I, I say this. I say this, Chris. I think that sometimes people feel like just because I'm not informed and I don't want to. So the reason we don't talk about trans topics on playback is because even though Lo has an opinion on him, I don't. I haven't looked at the research. I don't have one trans friend. I'd be talking out of my ass and just mm -hmm. having to take for the sake of having to take. If you want to call no, that censorship, it please. is what it is. Oh, but I'm, 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 I'm on the camp that I just don't Listen, care. That is what the fuck you call a good informed person to realize when you're not informed. Stop mm -hmm. talking about shit that you don't know nothing about. Fam, this the problem with the internet. And like, it's gay, it's, yo, it's giving too many fucking people, like, oh, uh, fake ass, you get, you get oh, first of all, it gave too many people, um, what do I say? They feel like they have to comment on everything. Yes. You don't, you don't. Fam, it's a lot of shit that I don't know about. So, one of the most powerful things you can say is, I don't know. But that's the problem. Motherfuckers have gotten away from that. Bro, Asian has said he's not really been around nobody from that community. He these haven't had conversations. He hasn't done research. So whatever he says, he's gonna be talking from straight up uninformed. He don't know. But the problem is he's gonna be he's gonna be, he's gonna be saying shit for the sake of saying shit. Oh, it's for the sake of saying shit. But the problem is, I don't know who I don't know young guns research and things like that. Let's say, for example, Young Dunn didn't do research. The problem is when a nigga that didn't do research has such a strong opinion, you be seeing a lot of dumbass shit. And you be like, and y'all niggas be so strong about something you know, you know shit about. You know, you know nothing it about. It's people who are who are not informed. They speak as if they are informed and they know what they're saying. And then the people that, like, let's say they have an audience, the audience that's listening that's not informed, 
take the information they're taking in from somebody who else is not uh, is, is also uninformed and then becomes and another uninformed fact. motherfucker that thinks that they exactly. know exactly and thinks that they know shit. And the thing is, bro, honestly, if you go watch some of the people's that's uninformed stream, the whole chat, nah, that's facts, it's facts, it's facts. Oh, now that other nigga know what he's talking about. Nah, nah, I ain't gonna lie, you right about that, you right about that. It just becomes a fucking echo chamber, bro. It becomes a bunch of motherfuckers that don't really know shit, haven't done no research, agreeing with somebody, thinking that he's done the research for you. And guess what? Newsflash, he ain't do none himself. Mm-hmm. But we can so we can play the video. And it's not at a place of it's like, not, there's a, there's it, a lot of things in the world I don't you care don't have, about. You don't have to care to have an opinion, though. Yeah place of it's like not, there's a it is what it is i could but vouch with him I'm, on that because certain things I mean, I i'm on that the I'm camp that i just don't care own. and it's not I mean, at a place of like not, there's a there's it, a lot of things in the world i don't care have, about you don't have to care to have an opinion though yeah no that's the I, thing he said i can relate I'm, to this though yeah. it, everybody has an opinion everybody has like it's no you don't bro. no no that's not the case at all because some people don't have an opinion on that you don't think yo i don't have an opinion on rugby because i don't know nothing about it there's no no i can't say i hate if, if you ask me about the genocide going on in China, I know such surface level knowledge. Agent, you're a man, bro. Like, you think you can be a woman, bro? If, if look, you ask me a question like that, and if I thought it was answer. important for the success <laughs> of the chat, this is a, this is what we're it's talking not about. dodging. You're, talking you're, about. It's no, almost no, as if no, 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 you're yo, forced. This is my problem with this shit, and I'm sorry, I, I make you keep pausing. Niggas, take your perspective, how you were born, how you grew up, and think that every single child grew up that same way. Mm -hmm. Every single child has the same thoughts that you had. It's not like that. Life ain't black and white. People are fucking complicated. My nigga, you can have twin children identical and they be completely fucking different. So for you to think that every, every child is, every child grows up and knows that they're this, knows that they that, it's, it's honestly, it's really fucking ignorant. I don't, I, I've never been in a situation that when I was a child, I thought, yo, I might not be in the right body. Never been in that situation. Luckily for me, I grew up knowing who I was. I grew up knowing what I like. And I ain't gonna lie, shit, like I said, it's late night. Nigga, as a kid, man, I started early looking at them goddamn, looking at, looking at women. I'm like, oh, we, I need some of that. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but I need it. But I, but I am understanding of, yo, somebody else might've grew up different. Somebody, somebody, I don't, I don't know. I, it's, it's a lot about that shit I don't know. So I don't talk about it. If you telling me that that's your reality, all right, bet. It's your reality. That's what you on. I'm not gonna fight you. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna have to argue about what you What the fuck am I gonna fight you for? About what you felt like. That's nuts. I don't care. And, and, and yo, there's literally nothing wrong with just not caring about shit, I, bro. That's what I'm saying. But but nigga, but niggas feel like you always have to have an opinion. You always have to care. You have to like always be like ready to give a a, a, a convoluted answer to some shit that you might not even know anything about. Like, right, come on. You said I watched this uh, stream live. I was an Asian Asian chat waller. Yeah, I tried to watch. I had to watch. I watched the whole thing. But okay. it's, a, it's like it's a three hour stream. Or a four-hour stream, something like that. Honestly, bro, chat. I'm I'm being honest, man. If y'all could, please start to find things that you really got fake opinions about. That maybe the internet has changed because the internet has changed all of us in certain in one way or another. We've been on this bitch all the time. Start mm -hmm. to start to find that shit out, and when you realize I really don't care about that shit, start to adopt not caring. Because I promise you, life is so much easier, fam. We I can't be worrying about what the fuck is going on overseas. I don't know what it is. I'm sympathetic to a lot of people's causes, but I don't know who's right. I don't know who's wrong. Listen, I'm trying to buy my mama a motherfucking house. That ain't got nothing to do with me. I don't know who, what this girl thought that she was born at. Mm-hmm. Okay, you said your name is this, I'ma call you your name. I don't care, nigga, cause shit. Nigga, if you told me your name was Jason in the beginning, I would've fucking called you Jason in the first fucking place. I don't give a fuck what the fuck you think your name is. I don't care. Okay, that's your name. I'm gonna call you your name. Stop giving a fuck about fake shit you don't care about, bro.
I keep I even keep it on the lighter note. When niggas be doing the console war shit and they ask you questions like that, listen, I just don't give a damn. I'm gonna get everyone anyway. No fuck. I don't care. I promise you, bro, real shit. Life becomes so much easier when you just start to be like, I don't care about that shit, bro. I don't care. When I'm telling you. You ready? Yeah. Listen to me to have an opinion. Otherwise, it's censorship. I'm telling you that topic is not important to me, so I've not put in thought and effort to if develop my own channel, opinion. Stuff like this should be important to you. These are like the biggest issues. What does that have to be the type of content those, we make? Which I agree. I think that if you're not informed enough on it, you probably shouldn't speak on something, especially something that can impact people's lives. Like we can have a debate back and forth on what exactly is. Uh, There's so many things on this planet um, to talk about. So they try to just put, to everything. put Asian in the box. I can avoid the topic if I want. I don't like the idea that if you don't have an extreme opinion, it's less genuine. Yeah, I feel like there's something genuine about coming to your own conclusions. For sure, like that'd be like, if, he's that'd be like yeah, it's like Democrat or Republican, is. but like you gotta believe everything one group says. But the fuck, you pick like and choose which person. policies you feel fuck like up. fit based on your decision making ability. I just feel like most regular adult human beings are capable of coming to their own conclusions outside of just agreeing with Either anything one, one whole group of philosophy says. In my personal opinion, but that's not. I hate all day. What the fuck? I also say you're in the matrix. They get, they get, they get programmed. That's a fact. But Spiegel basically yo, said yo, that, which I think, yeah, I agree. I think that you yeah, shouldn't that's, formulate that's an one. opinion yeah, unless okay. you are, especially something to that magnitude. I was formulating an opinion about pink sauce that went viral on TikTok. That doesn't, you know, that's, that's surface level stuff. But we talking about something that impacts, uh, you know, millions of people's lives. Real shit. You should probably be more impactful. I mean, more formed on it. We did the same thing with the Amber Heard situation. I'll be on most of the day, bro. I don't be, don't don't be taking my video be the people are calling us out. I know, you gotta stop We were right. wrong, and we had to address you it. You know yeah, that. I agree. You should be more informed on certain things. Us just jumping out the window on Yeah, it's okay to start talking about surface level shit, because obviously, I don't give a fuck. Pink sauce is a good example. I don't give a fuck about pink sauce. But it's funny, so we can talk about it. But if we talk about like some real life shit, and I don't know much about it, I'm be like, You're incentivized to continue to have provocative opinions, because you know people don't want to share provocative opinions. A regular take I make is not gonna be shared by people as like what? Who the fuck is in the background? You know how sticky Who feet is this? Oh shit, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, you <just> got <laughs> Yo, who the fuck man? It gotta be Kai. Why is it saying you know how sticky it gets? Why is Kai back there laying down? I don't believe it. Whoa, did you see this very <laughs> common Drake sense take? Or did you see this very, but like a, a ridiculous take like Andrew Tate saying that women should wear their fucking body count on their foreheads that was shared everywhere. Everybody <laughs> saw that. Yeah. So I think there's something to be said about like, you can't pitch it as though I'm fence riding and that's the easier route. If we're looking at examples of people talking in extremes and going viral and being celebrated for it. If you're gonna be extreme, just be informed. When you jump out the window, you say things that are not informed, you say things that are just falsely incorrect. Like you insinuated that we get a bunch, way more sponsorships on this channel and we've only had one sponsorship on this channel this entire time. Oh. But you jump out the window and say that because you're not informed, so mm. you're just saying things. We agree it's to disagree talking. for the most part. So then Sneeko brought on a good friend of his, Luke. Luke was a Money good, to small guy. Oh, good fucking good guy. Man. He was a good guy, man. He was, he was a, good a guy. swell Honestly, guy. So bro, that, Luke, that he's a truth teller. At least that's so what they were told to annoying, us. Bro. And then while Lord, speaking truth, you know, they asked him about you rap another you know, the, motherfucking the, the Drake Luke lyric. Going on right I'm now, a, I'm gonna take your Luke, ass. Luke, instead of answering the straight up, your ass out. Nigga, the whole verse. He got to tapping. He got to tapping immediately. There's no point in saying that gay people are evil and not even not even that it's a distraction. Go back one second. I don't have an opinion about it. I don't have to have an opinion about everything that. He got to tapping immediately. There's no Luke. Instead of answering it straight up, he start. He got to tap man shoes. And he got to tapping. He got to tapping immediately. There's no point in saying that gay people are evil. And not even, not even that it's a distraction. Like I don't have an opinion about it. I don't have to have an opinion about everything that I come across. Right. Like maybe I just look and I'm like, okay, well, it is what it. Like I'm not paying right. attention. I, I just, don't have the facts. I just so had no that opinion. same thought, and I was just <laughs> ostracized on stream for not giving a fuck about everything that crossed my path. You ever ask yourself, how the fuck do you decide what you care about? Is it proximity? It gotta be someone close to you? It doesn't have to affect you? But it's some things you're just not gonna care about. It doesn't mean it's not important. It just means it's not for you to handle. I just, right. I can't believe nah, Sneeko, you just I think you're, criticize you're me for the same right. thing that Luke is doing, but you're not saying nothing to Luke right now. No, you don't can't even have, have any distraction? opinion at all. You don't have any opinion at all. Oh, but this, that this, Luke doesn't have an opinion on food box. It's the same thing happening. His dick opinion ride. is that it's a distraction. Nigga, it, of course it's a distraction. Everything you do is a distraction from something else you could be doing. Thank Everything you. could qualify as a distraction. Oh my God, no, thank you. Yo, I fuck with agent, right? bro. It's, it's meant to. Oh my God. God. A lot of good Bro, bro and, and like, look, bro, Let's bro, this back. nigga Sneeko was, I'm rewinding. I ain't gonna talk too much, but. You good. This nigga Sneeko was on this, this loop nigga dick. 
heavy. Heavy. Like, like this nigga would just stick up for this nigga. Cause you know what he was saying before? He said, I'm gonna get my friend Luke. He's a, he's a millionaire. He has a lot of money. He knows a lot of people. Uh, he's way smarter than I am. You know what I'm saying? When, he, when, you talk, when you talk about a nigga like that, Bro, you I might already wanna, know, you I might already know how pick like, up. like come on, bro. But yo, fam, this is this, this is what them fucking red pill niggas be doing. Like, and now I'm mad because I I just I didn't know the difference between red pill and blue pill, but I started to realize I think Sneeko's red pill, and now I'm fucking mm -hmm. learning weird internet shit, man. Like, this is yeah, the problem with the fucking too. internet, my nigga. It's the problem with the fucking internet, bro. Real shit. I'm fucking yo weird internet shit. But fam. Money definitely don't equals intelligence. Absolutely. fucking I'm telling but, you. But fam, my nigga. Uh, damn, what about this? Oh, yeah. About Asian. Yo, the red pill niggas, they be like, no, man. See, I don't get on TikTok because TikTok is a distraction. It's meant to keep you away while the elite is buying, is buying up all the land. While the elite mm -hmm. is telling you to stay away from other people. While the elite is... My nigga, everything in life can be deemed as a distraction to another person. What I'm doing right now... <clears throat> People could be saying I'm distracting myself from getting the eight hours of sleep that I need. Hey, yep. nigga, while I'm out doing fucking real estate and buying up houses in my local market, niggas can say, hey, you distracting yourself from, from buying bigger properties because the elite is doing this. Everything can be deemed as a distraction. Watching TV you, can be you, deemed as a when distraction. You, when, you have, when you're having a bad day and instead of just wallowing in your sadness, you decide to talk to your mans, talk to your friends, play a game, all those things are distracting you from how you're feeling. Everything you do on a day-to-day -day basis distracts you from another thing that you could be doing. Absolutely. fucking lutely Come on, bro. But, okay. I, let me just say one point, because I don't know what they talk about in the video. I'm mm -hmm. trying to make it brief. No, you're good. So, so you, can't, you can't see my mouse, right? No. Okay, so the dude in the bottom left, right? Yes. Luke. He has on a Balenciaga t-shirt, right? Okay. Okay, so let's break this down. Luke told Sneeko, they they were they were like on a vacation somewhere. Luke told Sneeko, "Hey, you gotta buy some better. You gotta buy some better pants. You gotta buy some better shorts. You got you got shit with holes in them. You know what I'm saying?" And Sneeko didn't combat that. He said, "Okay, that's cool. I'm gonna get some new get some new clothes." And I think Low or Agent one of them said, "Isn't that isn't that like conf uh like confirming to the Matrix that you gotta yes. dress a certain way to?" To look the part so that you get in, in different rooms and stuff. Yeah, and they agree yes, but then sneak. And then Low brought it back and was like, "Okay, so you say that, but when me and agent said that we do YouTube and we cut some stuff out to play within the lines of YouTube, you were arguing us down, but you're okay when Luke says it. Come on, bro. Come on. I'm another, not gonna another, lie. Another case of this nigga sucking his dick, bro. For no reason. I ain't reason. gonna lie. Real shit. I don't know everything, but if everything what you see in me is the case, what in the dick suck was this shit going on? Bro? What is going on? And then, and then one more, because someone hey, in your Kobe chat said... Time. That's a motherfucking fact. Someone in your chat said, niggas with money doesn't mean that they're smart, right? Yes. So look, so back to this nigga's t-shirt, right? What's good, V? Back to this nigga's t-shirt. So he has on, and then they brought it back to him. He said, look, you're conforming to the Matrix too. You have one. You have it on a, a, a Balenciaga T-shirt, and he said, and he said, I I made a promise to myself. Whenever I get money, I'd have nice shirts, and I'd buy whatever, and I eat wherever I want to. You know that's cool. You, if you make if you if you make a promise to yourself when you're poor that I'm gonna give myself two things when I'm rich is that's nice shirts, and I can eat whatever I want to. Fine. So he says that, and then and I think Agent said or Lo said. Okay, so obviously that shirt has a lot of importance to you. Mm -hmm. And he just, he would not admit that the shirt was important, even though he said before that his dream was to buy nice shirts. Yes. So now, and then he kept arguing, like, no, this shirt doesn't mean anything. This shirt doesn't mean anything to me. You can take the Balenciaga logo off and, it, and it's the same thing. But if, So you but, can't say no, one but, thing. But the thing is, even if it is the same thing, bro, that's fucking cap. Because even if it was the same shirt, nine times out of 10, you wouldn't buy it. Yo, exactly. basic fucking red t-shirts. You pass by them all the fucking time. Most time you don't even check the quality. You don't mm -hmm. check. You don't check how much cotton in that shirt. You don't check how much. Yo, yo, yo you don't check how I feel. You you don't look up to see if it shrinks when when you wash it. But when you see Balenciaga on something, you automatically if that's something that you into, you like. Oh, I need that. 
you on that shirt, dick. <laughs> 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 that's me. You be raving about that shirt. Stop it, bro. It, it's because it's important to you, bro. If that's important to you, it's okay. Not saying that it's wrong. It's a, but y'all niggas be wanting to sound so fucking woke. Niggas be wanting to I'm sound like, you. oh man, I think I'm so different. No, you nigga, you're not. You just sound fucking dumb. There's nothing wrong with one night shit. But don't don't say that you want night shit and then turn around and say none of this shit matters. That's just not true. Nigga's weird, man. Nigga got a nigga got a parking garage full of Mercedes. All you ever drive is Mercedes. These cars don't mean nothing. I'll pull up in the Honda. We'll do it. Do it. <laughs> Bullshit ass nigga. Are you ready? Yeah. Big Ben Dad, thanks for the Something prom. else you could be doing. Everything could qualify as a distraction. Let's go, sweets. No, it's, it's Big Banana Bounty just to... subscribed. Say it again? We're just choosing the, uh, let's direct the conversation back at the what? matrix itself. Let's go back to that. Which I found very interesting and odd to me when Agent did the same thing about the trans situation immediately. You, they were on your ass. They were all, no, 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 no. I know such surface level knowledge. Agent, you're a man, bro. Like, you think you can be a woman, bro? If, look, you asked me a question like that, and if I thought yeah, it was I important know. for the success <laughs> of the chat. This is, a, this is what we're it's talking not about. It's not dodging. You're, it's hold almost on, as if on, you're on, forcing on, me to have on. an opinion. Otherwise, it's censorship. I'm telling you, that topic is not important to me. Direction, like, I don't have an opinion about it. I don't have to have an opinion about everything that I come across. Come on, bro. Like, maybe I just look and I'm like, okay, well, it is what it is. Like, I'm not paying bro, attention. I, I just, don't have the facts. I just have the same Smoking a cigarette. Smoking a cigarette. And not giving a fuck. I on stream for not giving a fuck about everything that crossed my path. I can't believe, nah, Sneagle, you just I think you're, criticize you're making, me for the same right. thing that Luke is doing, but you're not saying nothing to Luke right now. I, know. I find it interesting when people That's don't hold true. others to the same standard. They yes. hold others. You feel me? Like, how do you decide who's held to what standard? I felt like I was being held to a standard that Luke wasn't being held to just because Sneeko agreed with what Luke was saying. And I don't try and be aggressive in conversations because I feel like I will never be able to successfully get my point across if I'm just screaming at somebody. So I just kept my cool and tried arguing my point, but it just felt hypocritical. I feel like oh, the uh, I feel like the responsible thing to do is just admit that, damn, I did hold you to a different standard. If I'm going to criticize Agent for quote unquote, not believing all in one thing and quote unquote fence riding, coming to my own conclusions, then you should do the same for Luca was ducking and dodging a question when Don asked it. I asked a very honest and simple question about like the monkeypox thing. Mm. And I felt like he bobbed and weaved that. And then- No, you wanted to say that gay people are sinful because of the monkeypox. No, that's not. So I, what, well, I, just, what did, what did you I didn't bob and weave it. I just don't have an opinion about it. Maybe I just don't care enough about it. So can I truly not have an opinion about it? I mean, I, I don't have an you, opinion about everything. So that's why I, I told you. I, I, I gave you, I gave you, I gave you very plain and simple information. You see, this is the same thing you were just no, criticizing. No, no, hold on. I don't you have an opinion about it. You were just criticizing Agent and Lowe. Okay. And now, but I don't have an opinion about it. Shout out to Don. Shout out to Don. Shout out to Don. Listen, listen. Don kept, Don kept the same energy that he had for Agent and Lowe with Luke. You know what? Basically, he got on their ass just like he got, he got on his ass just like he got on their ass. So you know what? With that, I have way more respect for Don, honestly. Because you know what? If you're going to stay consistent in your shit, that's what you believe. And I, yo, honestly, I don't get on the internet to change niggas' minds. I don't get on the internet to change niggas' minds. I swear to God, fam, chat, honestly, let me let, me let y'all into the mind of trade. I often, if I find out that somebody's a different religion is me, I often, and I, I don't bring my religion, but I don't want to talk about it on streaming or shit like that, right? But... I would often talk to you and have a conversation of why you believe that, things like that. But just for the sake of learning and knowing, I can I can disagree with everything that you believe, but I'm not gonna be disrespectful about it. I wanna know, mm -hmm. I wanna learn, and I wanna see what y'all believe, why y'all believe it. And then after I get my information, I'm like, all right, bet, I understand where you're coming from, right? So that, that, that uh, the reason why I bring it up is that gives you an example of, I don't have to agree with the, I, mean, I, I don't have to agree with everything that somebody says to have respect for you. Now, with Young Dunn, if you consistent in your shit and you calling out bullshit, even when it's uh, even when it's all, all okay on your side, I'm all right with that, bro. You believe what you believe. I fuck with you. Mm -hmm. Like, but yo, that, you, you know what that means? That shows to me that Young Dunn has an opinion that he 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 he, he that he probably developed on his own. Sneeko, you flip flopping. You don't know what the fuck you believe because if one. It's okay for one person to say they don't have an opinion, but if agents said it, 
since you don't believe the agent is fucking red pill, then when agent said he don't have an opinion, oh, I can't do that. Oh, I don't believe, I don't agree with you. That's fucking nuts. It just it all it all just kind of felt odd to me, especially when he nerd. basically said the exact same thing you said. Like Man, I don't I don't care. Word. I don't I don't really care. I don't I don't really have an opinion on it. It's all nothing but a distraction. Which again, is, I don't I don't have a problem with it. If you truly believe that to be the case, it's fine. Yeah, it probably is a distraction. Distraction is one of the key words. Looking that way, my boy. Yeah, distract distraction and programming. Those are the two distraction words. Distraction and programming, and it's yeah. and it's like me talking to low is distracting me from acknowledging that. This nigga is asleep behind us. <laughs> but me talking to y'all is distracting me from looking at this view. Out. Everything you do is a distraction from something else you could be doing. So you arguing, a distraction is not a, that doesn't have no merit to it. But it's just because I, I can't record videos with people the, around me, The thing me, was bro. really um, odd to me because I Man. missed this part. Sneeko, once he was like, once people were trying to say, hey, Sneeko, he's doing the same thing that Agent is doing. You're not holding him to it. Instead of, like you said, Sneeko acknowledging it, Sneeko is basically trying to walk this nigga through Saying something that he's like, no, say that thing you said. For but that, look, that's not true. You, you have an opinion about the pox? But, nah, but like, bullshit. there's it's nothing I'm carried. It's like that's dumb shit. Like I don't have, I don't care. Like I don't know. Well, yeah, I, your I, opinion we talk is that it's dumb. It's not that you have no opinion. I, You're saying I, that it's dumb and it's do you hear this? Right? You are forcing an opinion in his mouth. Bro, you are. You You're are forcing an opinion. Me and him are in the exact same position, but you're finding a way to argue on his behalf. I'm on the camp that I just don't care. I don't care. Like I just don't care. I don't care. Like I'm like nigga, stop trying to walk him through it, bro. He just said he doesn't have an opinion. He doesn't care. It's the same thing that he said, but you're not holding to that same standard. That's a bit off. So then the second thing was the Balenciaga thing that we spoke about earlier. This man has a Balenciaga shirt. Oh, they did talk about it. It's fine. I don't really care about it. If by that same logic you would have to perceive it to have value and which then means that you are willing to play within the matrix or within the programming to best benefit you or however else you want to up uphold the lifestyle that you want to have <laughs> which is the same thing he did later on when he told Sneeko to dress a certain type of way to play the role that best benefits you what's the what's the what is the point of the Balenciaga shirt because that also um, doesn't make any sense. <laughs> well it doesn't make sense when I was poor I promised myself two things that I would buy nice t-shirts and eat at any restaurant that I wanted. So those are my two promises to myself that when I got rich, I would just splurge on those two things. And those are the two things I splurge so on. So wouldn't that logic mean that you were participating in the matrix then? hundred percent, hundred percent. Sometimes I indulge brother, but what does that have to do with anything? Sometimes I just want to buy a nice t-shirt. First of all, you can't criticize other people for playing within the rules of what works, right? Because if you oh have a very extreme God, opinion, bro, you're like, well, I don't want to follow any rules people, and that's completely bro. up to you. Yes. But then you can't turn around and follow all the rules of like, well, you got to dress right to get into these parties and to talk to these people to have this access. When he told you you need to put on better pants, you say something then. Why would I? I need to get respect from people like I'm around millionaires and oh. I, I have whole, that's a true hey. point. I need to get respect you're, from the room I had. That's not sucking hey, dick. He's, he's no, no, right. no, right. I can't you're be in Dorado right. with a bunch of millionaires with holes in what? my shorts. You got a point. Well, that's uh, that's my, understanding well, the point. matrix and operating around it. Okay, but what I'm saying is what I'm saying is that if we did the same thing by your logic through YouTube, we're Doing, by your logic, we're doing the same thing on YouTube, and yet it came with criticism. How is that the same I don't, thing? I don't, you How just sat there the and said, because you, because you just sat there and said that we're playing within the confines of YouTube, and we and we um, edit certain aspects of the podcast and upload on Patreon. Is that not the same thing that's of working within the confines? That's not being truthful. Wearing clothes that look better is not censoring truth. That's just looking better. No, that's, that's not being truthful. Pause the video. You're not being truthful. You're not being truthful. You're not being truthful. You're not being truthful. You're not being truthful to you. Yes, it exactly. is. You're not You're being truthful yourself. to you. You don't dress like that. You don't talk like that. You don't think like that. But you're doing it in a room full of millionaires because you want to get their resources. You're not being truthful. You're not. You're fucking. Your your opinion is not real, my nigga. You are a fucking idiot. You're a fucking idiot. This nigga is slow, bro. This nigga is. This nigga him, is tweaking. What? Play it, bro. Man, this nigga's crazy. You're not being truthful. Well, wait, wait, looking better for what though? Because if, if those people cannot decipher or they don't want to give you the opportunity to tell your truth or they're willing to judge you based off of what you look and not based off of your actual character, then they're not also living in truth either. You're playing the same game. Cause, You're cause... playing the exact same game. You're just drawing your line differently, <laughs> but with like this like moral, you feel like you have this moral high ground, like you've done it better than other people. You're doing the same thing. Which is so odd because even if you believe that we're 
censoring ourselves. The concept still is, is the same, like you said. We are playing within the confines of the YouTube Hold rules, low hairline the rules that crazy. are set in place to best benefit us. And our, I believe, at least my end goal is some I form say, of financial bro, liberation. Bro, bro, so I don't facts. have to Leave the alone, the game. Luke then did said the exact same thing. And again, Sneeko is just like, the level of criticism and vitriol you have behind it is not the same. So that was also very odd to me, especially this nigga sitting here telling me that a Balenciaga shirt has no worth to it. I was like, nigga, come on, it has worth to you. Come on, let's let's stop, stop the cap. It's like that shirt isn't doesn't have that much value. It has at, no value. Has it, exactly, but because it has a a, a in money, uh, money name on it. Yeah, but but what what do we no, we agree that it has no money. value. Not no, but to, no, no, to you it does though. Correct. No, I just bought a shirt that I like. That's all just, I did. You just said, just, said what's you, the difference? You promised yourself. There is no, I you said that I promised value. myself is, is when I was right, that's, poor. There's meaning in that. Because I'm not saying shit. There's meaning. Yeah, right, no, I just buy it because right. I like it. If right. I buy myself a like Rolex, it, I'm not saying I, someone I just buy it because I like it. Because I'm not saying someone's intrinsic. 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 Nigga, when you give your kids, when you buy something for your kids, like let's say for example, I, I, I'm bringing up watches because I've been studying watches so low key, I'm starting into watch. Listen, Bow, I signed a crazy contract. I go out, buy myself a $20,000 watch. That watch has not only the value of how much I paid for, but it has sentimental value to me because that's something that a lot of niggas start to overlook. Sentimental value mm -hmm. is value, my nigga. So, that that watch now has value because it you know, every time I look at that shirt, it reminds me of man, you did your thing in that contract. When this guy buys that buys those shirts, hey, he walks in the store and it reminds him of a time that oh shit, I used to couldn't do this. Let's do it. Not only, yeah, look, maybe you might not think it has value because at the end of the day is just a shirt, but it has sentimental value to you because it's showing you where you where the fuck you came from. That's value. You can't under you can't understate that. Right. Buy because I like it. Right, but no, I buy because no, I like it. And I'm not saying I, someone I is intrinsically like buy it. because not, they they yeah, buy we're saying nice it has value to treat you. themselves. So it has value to you then. No, because I could do yes. without it. But I could do without it. Meaning it's not uh, but the bigger picture I, I want to paint here is that look, Sneak, I don't I don't have an inherent problem with you. I don't know why they, they kept pushing like. Are you looking at watches? I like learning this shit, man. I'm tired. Of it. Like you got a problem? Oh, right? you, I forgot. Don't you got a you got a problem with them? Don't you? Right? You, you do bust it down. No, I don't. Oh, okay. I have I have no problem. I'm gonna get a plane too. But the other, I guess the other problem that I have is the same thing we said in the Andrew Tate video about how he's wrong, which is the concept of if you are going to be a part of Red Pill. Yeah, it's a bit hypocritical that you don't continue I to love playing truth, Jay, no even if it's people within the community people can be false prophets people can be sitting there spewing rhetoric just to be a part of the community that they actually don't believe in and you should constantly challenge people regardless if they're part of your community or not because when you don't do it or you just spew bullshit it just becomes convenient for you and it's just what's so crazy to me because Sneeko I know you believe that because you say the same thing about politicians Ew. you say the same thing about Time women money you say I the same thing even about me Ew. so it's all if it's just convenient <laughs> for you you just get away with it and you don't really understand that you just did the exact same thing which was our original criticism on red pill the community that's being breeded within that red pill ideology that people are not actually doing the hard yeah, the work color balance on their camera is ass us. i don't know why you did oh, what you, you did in this stream it made no sense to me but you were being mad inconsistent with the level of criticism that you were levering towards us even though the nigga was doing the exact same thing and it was inconsistent. And also the criticism you gave to us that you also do as well. That did not make any sense. It just didn't, dog. Yeah, you don't need to be red pill to seek the yes. truth. You don't need to be, you don't need to, this fake matrix spirituality stuff, bro. You can have to oh convince me there's some God. merit to it. Because if you're just, if, if the purpose of the matrix is just to, what is that? Like, I've been, I've been watching so many Soluminati spiritual soul videos. I still, like, I, I sat in a convo with a guy who really believes this stuff. And he did a oh horrible God, job so of explaining to me. Fuck his ideology. Bro, Luke did a horrible job because oh he kept asking, headache. like, what is, what is it? Oh, game my God. This guy gave us, like, bro, three thinking about a game, game like, bro. Hey, but, hey, but, hey, man, those are just our thoughts. Yo, Sneeko, again, no no hard feelings. But the other video that we uh we were roasting that nigga, no. Damn, I just <laughs> had a good-ass <laughs> thought that ran across my head. but I Hey, yo, no hard feelings, Sneeko, but, um, you know, those are just our thoughts. If you missed the other video we're talking about, we'll put it on the screen right here. Also, if you, if you think we're not being genuine, you can definitely click that link in the description to see all, uh, all of Damn, our uncut stuff. Hey, the fully uncensored stuff exists. Huh? Hold on, I, I click it on all. 
I, I just had a good ass it's thought in my head, but it's I couldn't not remember on YouTube. it. Please but it's right. click it. But yeah. let them just let them. Um. In conclusion. Yeah. I can't. I don't. I don't say that word anymore. Gonna thank you for the niggas. Yeah, niggas yeah, is different, man. Months, bro. Expel gonna just subscribe. And, and then niggas get an echo chamber guy, of niggas that's also like them. Absolutely. So they, there's movie. never anybody that really calls them out on it, and they take public opinion and, and make that uh, and that confirms their shitty logic. Absolutely, fucking Lutely, bro. Absolutely, bro. Niggas like these niggas do not have real opinions. Um, and when you actually get down to the nitty gritty of a lot of their opinions, bro. It's not based in it's not based in much. Uh mm -hmm. y'all niggas are walking contradictions, but I don't blame you because you're human. But the problem is y'all want to call everybody else out on their contradictions, but just act like yours don't exist. Stop it. Stop it, bro. But run get your ass off that stream, man. Go ahead and get you something to eat, bro. <laughs>